Hi, and you're watching another Honest Review, and this time I'll be putting the Liberex Oscillation Facial Brush to the test. So I've got a pretty lazy beauty routine in that um, at night I just wash my face, moisturize, and go to bed. So adding in a little brush like this uh, wouldn't ordinarily have been top of my priority list, but I was sent this by Liberex for review. So I'm gonna use it every night for a couple of weeks and see how I get on. Now the oscillation part of the title is just a posh word for uh, movement. So this brush will move back and forward. And the idea is it gives your, your skin a really deep cleanse. Um, it's supposed to be particularly good for oily and congested skin. So there are lots of uh, facial brushes like this on the market. Some of them you can pay up to three figures for. This is a pretty low price one. It's um, £22.99 on Amazon UK and around $31.99 on Amazon in the US. Um, on the reviews on the UK site, out of over 50, it's been awarded 4.5 stars out of five. So that is a pretty good start as is the packaging. Let's take a closer look. So this is the box that the brush arrives in. Pull off the lid. There's a lovely contemporary feel to it, a little bit like a, an Apple product. Um, inside you've got the user manual and here's the little egg-shaped brush. Let's take it out and have a closer look. Here's the little egg-shaped brush. Um, I actually like the shape, it's very small. You can see against the, the size of my hand how small it is. Um, the brush head on top feels very soft, which is a positive sign because you don't want to put anything too harsh against your skin. Um, it's also charged, which I wasn't expecting. So it comes with three speed settings. And as you increase the speed, the idea is you get a deeper cleanse, so you can decide for yourself. Um, the first one is a massaging speed, and then the second is exfoliating. The third is designed to be a deep cleanse. The lid has these little air holes on the top so that the brush can dry out, which is a good idea. Okay, so let's take a look at the charging base. So the egg-shaped brush sits on top. The idea is it charges through the base, which you plug in to a power source through a USB cable that comes in the box as well. Um, it plugs in for an hour and a half, and then the idea is that you can continue to use this for 30 to 45 days from that point. Lastly, let's take a look at what's in this little box here. So the um, Liberex brush comes with an already fitted brush head and comes with this second one within the box. And it is just a softer brush and it is very soft. Uh, the idea is this should be used for people with sensitive skin. Okay, so now I'm gonna go and fully charge the Liberex brush and I'm gonna use it every night over a couple of weeks and come back and let you know how I get on. So it's two weeks on now and even a haircut later and I'm ready to share the results with you. First of all, I wanna show you the Liberex in motion as I use it every night. So I'm just gonna wet my face first as I do every night. And um, all I normally do in the evening is wash my face with Aveeno um, Ultra Calming Foaming Cleanser. So that's what I'm gonna do just now, just putting it over the T-zone. And then I'm gonna use the Liberex. I talked about the three modes earlier on. And I've been using it on the third and the highest mode uh, for exfoliation. So, easy to use. Just switch it on, turn it up to exfoliation mode, and I'm just moving it over the skin. And what's pretty clever about this is that after 20 seconds, there's just a slight pause in the vibration. It's a very gentle vibration and it changes mode and you know then to move on to the next area. Um, so I do each area for just 20 seconds.
after I've finished using the brush, I just clean off the foaming cleanser from my face again. And then that's then I, I moisturize and that's my nighttime routine over. So this is only adding another 60 seconds to the nighttime routine. Um, I don't know if you're able to see, but I have had a little bit of breakout over my nose and um, on my chin there. That is apparently quite normal for a facial brush and goes away, hopefully after a couple of weeks. So, I mean, I will keep going with it because I have seen that some of the pores are kind of clearing up, becoming a bit smaller. And also my forehead, which can get a little bit bumpy, um, that has stayed nice and clear. It was looking a little bit better anyway, naturally, before I started using the brush. Um, and I would say it's probably just a little bit clearer again. So one thing I did want to flag up about this is that um, the lid has little air holes which are supposed to let the brush dry, but I have noticed that um, even though I have wiped on a towel, rinsed it and wiped it on a towel after use, it has still been a little bit damp the next day and you don't want to have something damp for 24 hours because um, bacteria can build up. So what I've started to do is just let this dry out fully overnight before I replace the lid the next day. That's just a little tip. But overall, considering it's £22.99, for the price, I think this is a really good product. Easy to use. It's got these nice little touches like changing mode, um, just slowing down at 20 seconds to let you know to change um, position. The bristles are very soft. It's easy to use on your skin. I've got sensitive skin and apart from that little breakout, um, it's been very gentle. So I think overall, this is a product I would recommend. I think as well with that lovely packaging, this would make a great gift because it's a very impressive, it feels like a, a kind of significant uh, gift to receive. So nice little touch. In summary then, the Liberex is easy to use, it's low cost, it's effective. You really do get a good sense of clean after it. Not too harsh on the skin, uh, lovely design. So a good value product. On the cons, uh, this, I've had this little bit of breakout on the skin. I do believe from what I've read that that is normal, but it also has um, a softer brush that I could give a go as well, just to see if that helps with the little breakout. I think then I would recommend the Liberex. So thanks for watching. If you want to find out more about the Liberex, I've included a product link in the video description beneath this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you next time.